we are going to find the ABCD parameters of an ideal transformer and an ideal transformer is a hypothetical device having no losses in it and uh, this is how we represent an ideal transformer and it is having the tones ratio n is to 1 and it is a two port device this is port number 1 and this is port number 2 and the two dots in the representation denotes that this point and this point will have the rise and fall in potentials at the same time. I will explain the dot polarities in detail while discussing the magnetic circuits. Now moving on to the next point. For an ideal transformer, the self and mutual inductances are infinite but the ratio of self inductances is finite. And uh, we know that the ratio of V1 and V2 is equal to the turns ratio. Voltage V1 over V2 will be equal to N over 1. And from here we can say that the voltage on the primary side which is V1 is equal to N times voltage on the secondary side. And uh, let us say that this is equation number 1. And we know that in case of an ideal transformer there are no losses and hence the input power will be equal to the output power and the input power is equal to V1 multiplied to I1 V1 multiplied to I1 and the output power will be V2 multiplied to the outgoing current let's say I2 prime so V2 multiplied to I2 prime and we have found V1 is equal to N times V2 and therefore we can write NV2 in place of V1. So we have N V2 I1 equal to V2 I2 prime and V2 V2 will cancel out. So we have current I1 equal to 1 over N times current I2 prime. And uh, we can see that I2 and I2 prime are the currents in the same wire but in opposite direction. And therefore we can say that current I2 prime is equal to negative of current I2. And therefore current I1 will be equal to minus 1 over N multiplied to current I2. And uh, let us say that this is our equation number 2. And uh, we can write equation number 1 as V1 equal to N times V2 minus 0 times I2. And I am writing equation 1 like this because I want to have the standard equations we have in case of ABCD parameters. And uh, to have the second equation, I will write equation number 2 as I1 equal to 0 V2 minus 1 over n i2 and when you compare these two equations with the standard equations we have you will find parameter a is equal to n parameter b is equal to 0 parameter c is equal to 0 and the fourth parameter parameter d is equal to 1 over n so in this way we have obtained the ABCD parameters of an ideal transformer with the tones ratio n is to 1. Now what if I change the tones ratio to 1 is to n. In this scenario V1 over V2 will be 1 over n. This implies V1 is equal to 1 over n V2. And therefore we can say that parameter A will be 1 over n. Parameter B will be 0. I1 over I2 will be equal to negative of N and therefore I1 will be negative of N multiplied to I2 and this implies parameter C is equal to 0 and the fourth parameter parameter D is equal to N. So you can notice that how parameter A and parameter D are getting affected when we are changing the tones ratio to 1 is to n.
So remember the ABCD parameters for an ideal transformer and uh, now we are going to solve one example problem so that you will understand how you have to deal with the questions involving an ideal transformer. Here we have one two port network with an ideal transformer having the trans ratio 1 is to 2 and we are required to find the H parameters of this two port network and the first thing I will do is to divide the network into small small two port networks connected in cascade this is our network number one this is our network number two and this one here is our network number three and we will find out the ABCD parameters or T parameters of this network, this network and this network and then we will multiply them to have the T parameters of the entire network and finally we will convert them to have the H parameters. So let us first find out the T parameters of the first network and uh, we know how we can write down the T parameters of this network directly. Let's say the T parameters matrix is T1 and it will have the elements 1, Z, 0, 1 and Z is equal to 1 ohm therefore in place of Z we will have 1 and we have seen how to find out the ABCD parameters of an ideal transformer we have 1 over n 0 0 and n n is equal to 2 so we have 1 over 2 as the first element and the fourth element the last element of the matrix will be 2 let's find out the t parameters matrix of the third network connected in cascade it will be 1 4 0 1 now to find out the t parameters matrix of the overall network we will multiply t1 with t2 and then the result will get multiplied with t3 and after multiplication you will have the t parameters matrix as 1 over 2 4 0 2 and this implies the set of equations we will have for this two port network in terms of ABCD parameters is V1 equal to 1 over 2 V2 minus 4 I2 and current I1 equal to 0 V2 minus 2 I2. Now if you remember the set of equations we have in case of H parameters you will find we can have the second equation from this equation. From here we can have current I2 equal to minus 1 over 2 I1 plus 0 V2 and this means this is parameter H to 1 it is equal to minus 1 over 2 and this one here is our parameter H to 2 it is equal to 0 and the calculation of parameter H11 and parameter H12 is homework for you.